Hi guys, welcome back to the Sea Tom Pool Crew. And today we are at Hall's Well Quarry Park. And shout out to Marshall or Marshall for giving us the idea to come to this Hall's Well Quarry Park. And we are going to go check out this little rim thing here because apparently it's a, like a stone mine there. And also, at the end of this video, we're gonna tell you guys what what we're gonna rate this place and why we like it. Let's jump into it. Guys, we are headed to the quarry rim loop track and that's what I said before, like that rim stone mine. And it says it takes us 45 minutes loop track to take there and we're up for a challenge. Let's go. Guys, um, it turns out we were going the wrong way and we just f figured this out. The quarry rim track is that way and the Hall Swirls quarry park is this way. So we went the wrong way, so my was right. Let's go this way. Of those here. Mm -hmm. yeah. Guys, it looks like that over there is the wetlands. Because it's like water and they're like. This is what we came 
for the video for. Now, let's wow. Check that thing out. This actually looks pretty sick. Can we come up there? Oh, there's a little piece of meat. Guys, you're looking at something historical here because this Houseworld's Quarry has been here for a really long time. And if you want to know more about Houseworld's Quarry, check out check it out in the description below. We'll put more details in there. And flake off something a crowbar. Someone here like did a quote. It says right here. It's not quote. Yeah, it is. Guys, I think there's like a quote here by someone. It says the stone we found here held great promise for building slabs, were straight edged, easy to shape, and flaked off simply by crowbar. <gasps> and funny. here and these three are actually really important. I'll read the third one. Hallswell Stone, seven million years ago. Seven million. Volcanic <gasps> pressure pushed the magma through a vent in the column basalt and formed a lava dome. This cooled quickly to become this slab jointy rock. See, right there. What? And I think the, what is that? The Column basalt is right there. Yeah, it's right here. Look. Column basalt. Seven million years ago. Wow. Guys. Nice music. Anyways, I'm going to read number two. Ash and Scoria. This rumble was deposited over the column ba basalt for many thousands of years. Oxid Oxidation and weathering have produced the red and orange color in the layer. Which is those red things down there. Oh yeah. Red and I think ash I think ash scoria is that rock right here. Learning history today. Ash I know you didn't expect history class in this channel, ash but and you we, get it. We we do unexpected things, guys. Guys, you're not allowed to go in there because you can see there's a sign that says something, something danger. So I, we can't get in. Uh, I think we can go like on that place. So let's go. Check out the pool view. Yeah, let's do it. Yes, guys, we actually found a historical track. And we didn't want to show this in the video, but we decided to because this ja yeah, channel yeah. is really interesting and informational. Right you do not want to step in this trap. Otherwise, your mom will get really mad at you. And say, what? Did you do that on purpose? We know you did something. When I was really excited to see the mine, he thought we could go inside. But sadly, we cannot go inside. There's to go up there. Where is the oh sick boy? Oh, must be so cool.
guys, I told you guys at the start of this video I would rate this place from a scale of Weird. 1 to 10. And I personally would rate it an 8 out of 10 because of a couple reasons. It is a beautiful view, lots of history, but the reason why I'm not making it 10 out of 10 is because it's very, very windy up here and really rocky, lots of lots of ha choking hazards. Uh, I like it like this. Just like not. this, you can choke on this. Thank you to Om Marshall for Thank making this video happen. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Bye! Bye-bye!